That pretty much went away, I guess. Vito sent me. You're Connie, right? Yup. Connie DeMarco. Been keeping an eye on the smuggling business for Vito. Roy Thibodeau's in charge now, and it's a damn shit show. Why hasn't Greco bounced him yet? Oh, he bounced Roy right into a hole if he got to say so. Greco didn't pick Roy, and that puts a target on his back. Still, Roy's trying to sell the usual shit from out of Cuba. Cigars and rum, mostly. Hell, rumor has it they even selling medicine and shit to the Cubans. Sounds like Greco scrambling. <laughs> Imagine Greco thought his uncle Sal would give him a break, but no. So he's squeezing everyone, including Roy. If business gets any worse, Roy's gonna have to come down and see to it himself. Mind, Roy's got a few guys here and there. Might take some persuading, but I'll get him to talk. Hold of any Roy's guys yet? They're sure to talk if you, uh, ask just right. to Cuba for extra cash. I know where the shipment is. Your ass belongs to me. The law is gonna catch us running TVs or some shit. No, they just gonna catch us running medicine. Medicine we stole from a goddamn charity. Not only that, we selling it to them reds and goddamn <laughs> Cuba. Now you get it, Constance. My friend, they're peanuts with greenbacks the same as anyone else. Roy needs to pull his head out and stop doing every damn thing Greco tells him. understand is what kind of idiot makes his last stand at an old fun park. From what I hear, Richie wasn't going to be winning no awards for his smarts. Anyways. Yeah, anyway. What are we doing here, man? Sal pitching in with that crap. All units, fucker. pursuit is called yeah, off. Abandon search and return to patrol. Repeat, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrol. Whatever it is, it's way above what you and me get paid to know. <clears throat>
boys. Got it. Get over here. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. You and me, motherfucker. I'm the dad fucking hurry. <sighs> I'll figure out what that was. The hell was that?
to get the rest of us to walk out. She protests, she says. What are we supposed to do? Nobody talks. Okay, that didn't sound right. What the fuck was that? I'm on a you. No telling where he is. Go check he's hiding back there. Guess I'll try it. Oh.
wants to see that baby. I'll stay. You want to keep the family stuff out of the game? I'll ignore him. Y'all come on over this weekend. We'll be glad to have you. Fucking... Let's even try daddy. In my sight! Anybody follow you? Boy, it's rattled. Scared of Greco. Terrified of you. <laughs> Heard he starts sleeping at the warehouse. It's the only place he feels safe. Good. Means I have an easier time getting my hands on him. Once he's taken care of, we'll move in. Vito will turn things around. You'll see. What's that over there? <clears throat> Got lots of places to look. Oh, 
wonder if he's over there. Looks empty to me. It's only a matter of time till I find it. Fuck is mine. Huh? You boys see that? He's not getting nothing. Away from Try over there. Where do you get off to? Got lots of places to look. Huh? You see that fucking up, bitch? Yeah. You about to get yeah. fucked! Uh. Damn! Yeah. Yeah. Come on! Shit! I've gotta yeah. get behind something!
did to right. Oh. guys to secure the smuggling operation at the warehouse. Nice work. Those Fanooks never should have fuck with me. I'll send some of my crew. You take the Dark Union back, and then fuck Greco will be done. Today, I'm sure the file on Vito Skelet is about three feet thick, but that wasn't always the case. Hoover didn't even acknowledge the Mafia existed until 1957, so we weren't really keeping tabs on guys like Vittorio Scaletta till after that. Now, we know he served in World War II and did a six-year stint in prison for theft and illegal distribution of federal rations. It's, uh, it's generally believed he was a made member of the Falcone family in Empire Bay, though he's also a suspect in the death of Don Carlo Falcone. Now, if he did kill the Don, Vito must have had friends in high places because he was allowed to live. He was exiled, though, and forced to relocate down here, and the Commission convinced Sal Marcano to make Vito a lieutenant and give him some rackets. 